There is a world on our planet so vast and powerful it almost defies comprehension, the Pacific Ocean. Stretching from the icy shores of the Arctic in the north to the sun-drenched coasts of Antarctica in the south, the Pacific covers more area than all the land masses on Earth combined. It's not just a body of water. It's the blue heart of our world, driving our climate, shaping weather patterns and supporting astonishing life. Its waters are home to the greatest diversity of marine species on the planet, from the tiniest plankton to the largest whales. The Pacific is the largest, deepest and oldest ocean on Earth, holding more than half of the planet's free water. Its vastness is almost unimaginable, spanning over 63 million square miles and plunging to depths greater than Mount Everest is tall. Its calm surface hides the deepest trenches, the tallest underwater mountains, and the most violent volcanic activity on the globe. The Mariana Trench, the ocean's deepest point, is a place of perpetual darkness and crushing pressure, yet life still thrives there. For millennia, cultures have thrived along its shores, shaped by its rhythms and bounty. The Pacific has provided food, shelter, and a sense of identity to countless generations, weaving itself into the myths and traditions of island peoples. From ancient navigators who read the stars and waves to modern cities bustling with trade and innovation, the Pacific has been a source of sustenance, connection and inspiration. Its vast expanse has linked continents and cultures, fostering exchange and discovery. Its great currents act like rivers within the sea, transporting heat, nutrients and life across thousands of miles. These powerful flows shape weather, influence fisheries and connect distant ecosystems in a delicate balance. In this journey, we'll explore the Pacific's immense scale, its unique and mysterious creatures, and the dramatic forces, both natural and human, that shape its destiny. We'll witness the beauty, the danger, and the wonder that define this ocean. The Pacific is not just a feature on a map, it's a vital breathing system that affects us all. Its pulse can be felt in the rain that falls, the winds that blow, and the life that flourishes, both above and below its surface. Join us as we dive into the story of the Pacific Ocean. The Pacific Ocean scale is almost unimaginable. It covers more area than all the world's land masses combined. Stretching from the icy shores of Antarctica in the south to the Arctic in the north, and from Asia and Australia in the west to the Americas in the east, its vastness is truly breathtaking. Its surface spans over 63 million square miles about a third of the globe. To put that in perspective, if you combined all the continents, the Pacific would still be larger. It's a body of water so immense that it could easily swallow every country on Earth and still have room to spare. From space, the Pacific dominates the planet's face, a vast expanse of blue that stretches beyond the horizon in every direction. Astronauts often remark that the Pacific is the most striking feature of Earth when viewed from orbit. This immense size shapes global climate and weather, creating patterns that affect continents thousands of miles away. The Pacific's vast surface acts as a giant heat engine, driving winds, storms, and ocean currents that influence weather across the entire planet. The Pacific holds more than half of all ocean water with an average depth of 4,000 meters. In some places, it plunges even deeper, reaching into the mysterious darkness of the ocean's trenches. Its underwater landscape is more dramatic than any on land. Abyssal plains that stretch for miles, towering sea mounts rising from the depths and deep trenches like the Mariana, the deepest point on Earth. Life thrives in this three-dimensional world with new species discovered on every deep sea expedition. From glowing jellyfish to ancient fish, the Pacific's depths are a frontier of discovery, teeming with creatures adapted to extreme conditions. Crossing the Pacific is a journey of weeks, with endless blue above and teeming life below. For centuries, explorers and sailors have braved its vastness, often traveling for days without seeing land, surrounded only by the rolling waves and the mysteries beneath. The ocean's scale creates its own internal systems, seasons and regions. Massive gyres circulate water for thousands of miles, while unique ecosystems form in isolated corners, each with its own climate and life forms. It is the defining feature that makes the Pacific the planet's primary life support system, sustaining countless species and shaping the very environment in which we live. The Pacific's immense scale is not just a fact of geography, it is a force that touches every corner of our world. 
The Pacific Ocean is not a barrier, it's a vast highway connecting continents and cultures. Its waters touch Asia, Australia, North and South America, forming a ring of diverse coastlines. Powerful currents like the Kuroshio and California transport heat and nutrients, moderating climates and fueling rich fisheries. For wildlife, the Pacific is a bridge. Whales migrate thousands of miles and sea turtles return to their birth beaches, linking distant shores. The health of one part of the Pacific can impact life thousands of miles away. Humanity has long used the Pacific as a bridge, from the first people reaching the Americas to Polynesian navigators settling remote islands. Today, it's the world's busiest shipping route, connecting global economies. The Pacific remains the great connector, shaping both nature and human history. Its influence is felt across continents and generations. Deep in the vast expanse of the western Pacific Ocean lies the Mariana Trench, a place shrouded in darkness, immense pressure and endless mystery. This remote chasm is the deepest part of our planet's oceans, a world few have ever seen. At its lowest point, known as the Challenger Deep, the trench plunges nearly 11,000 metres below the surface, so deep that if Mount Everest were placed inside, its peak would still be submerged by more than two kilometres of water. Down here, the pressure is over a thousand times greater than at sea level. It's an environment so extreme that most technology struggles to survive, yet astonishingly, life finds a way. Strange and delicate snailfish, along with tiny amphipods, thrive in these depths. They survive by feeding on marine snow, a constant shower of organic particles drifting down from the sunlit waters far above. These remarkable creatures demonstrate life's incredible resilience. Evolving unique adaptations to withstand freezing temperatures, total darkness and crushing pressure. Their existence challenges our understanding of biology and the limits of survival. The trench itself is a dynamic subduction zone where the massive Pacific Plate is slowly sliding beneath the smaller Mariana Plate. This ongoing process fuels volcanic eruptions and powerful earthquakes constantly reshaping the ocean floor. Scientists explore these depths in specially designed submersibles, revealing the powerful geological forces that shape our planet's surface and drive the cycle of continents and oceans. The Mariana Trench serves as a living laboratory offering rare opportunities to study geology, chemistry and the very limits of life on Earth. Each expedition uncovers new species and insights into our planet's history. More than just a record holder for depth, the Mariana Trench is a window into Earth's deepest secrets, a place where the unknown still reigns. Its mysteries continue to inspire explorers, scientists and dreamers, driving humanity to push the boundaries of discovery and understanding. The Pacific is ringed by the Ring of Fire, a vast belt of intense geological activity. This horseshoe-shaped zone is home to 75% of the world's volcanoes and 90% of its earthquakes. Here, the Pacific Plate grinds beneath continental plates, creating volcanoes and triggering powerful quakes. Iconic peaks like Mount Fuji and Mount St. Helens are constant reminders of the molten world below. The Ring of Fire's volcanic soils are fertile, supporting millions while geothermal energy offers clean power. Yet the risks are real. Earthquakes and tsunamis can devastate distant shores. People living here have developed resilience and deep respect for these forces. The Ring of Fire is a dramatic illustration of Earth's ever-changing nature. In the North Pacific, a troubling phenomenon has emerged. The Great Pacific Garbage Patch. It's not a solid island, but a vast soup of plastic debris, much of it broken into microplastics. Covering over 1.6 million square kilometers, it's a stark testament to our disposable culture. Plastic comes from all around the Pacific Rim, trapped by currents and accumulating over decades. Marine life suffers. Animals mistake plastic for food or become entangled in ghost nets. Microplastics enter the food chain, affecting creatures from plankton to humans. Cleanup is difficult, but the real solution lies on land reducing plastic use and improving waste management. The garbage patch is a sobering reminder of the ocean's limits. Our actions on land have far-reaching consequences for the Pacific. The Pacific is home to giants. The blue whale, the largest animal ever, cruises its depths. These whales, along with giant squid, great white sharks and manta rays, rely on the Pacific's rich feeding grounds. 
Many undertake epic migrations connecting distant parts of the ocean. Their presence signals a healthy ecosystem as apex predators and major consumers. Sadly, many are threatened by overfishing, habitat loss, pollution and climate change. Protecting these species means safeguarding the entire Pacific ecosystem. Their survival is intertwined with the health of the ocean itself. The giants of the Pacific remind us of the wonders and fragility of marine life. Scattered across the Pacific are thousands of islands, each a unique world shaped by isolation. These islands are natural laboratories for evolution, home to species found nowhere else. The Galapagos Islands inspired Darwin's theory of evolution with their remarkable diversity. In Polynesia, islands like Hawaii showcase adaptive radiation, where a few arrivals evolved into thousands of unique species. This biodiversity is a direct result of splendid isolation. But these ecosystems are fragile, vulnerable to invasive species and climate change. Rising seas threaten to submerge low-lying atolls, while introduced animals can devastate native life. Protecting these islands is a critical conservation challenge. They are irreplaceable reservoirs of genetic diversity and living museums of evolution. The Pacific's islands are treasures that must be preserved for the future. The Pacific Ocean is the heart of our planet's life support system. Its health is directly linked to our climate, food security and even the air we breathe. Vast forests of phytoplankton in its sunlit layers produce more than half of Earth's oxygen. The Pacific regulates global temperatures, absorbing and redistributing solar heat. It has shielded us from the full effects of climate change, but at great cost to its own health. The Pacific's scale and diversity are unmatched, yet much of it remains unexplored. We face a critical moment. Pollution, overfishing and warming threaten its delicate balance. By understanding our connection to the Pacific, we can act to protect it. The Pacific is our blue heart, its future and ours depend on the choices we make today.